What is up, everybody? Welcome to a special Friday night episode of This Week in Perfect Team. I'm your host, Chris Jardine, Director of Live Content Services for Out of the Park Baseball. It is episode number 125. It is Friday, July 16th, 2021. We have a great action-packed half hour of content for you tonight some brand new cards gonna be jumping into packs can't wait to show them off it's gonna be a lot of fun and then immediately after the stream we're gonna be followed by dishnet and the twipt weekly showdown perfect draft tournament a long friday night episode here before we get going uh Anything I show off on the stream tonight, uh, the LE card and the other cards will be in packs in one hour's time. So 9 p.m. Eastern time is when everything will be in packs tonight. Um, so same format as on Thursdays. We're going to do the stream. Stuff will be in packs an hour later. Uh, and then next week, we'll be back on our regular Thursday night schedule. Uh, and we should be good. I don't have any other vacations or anything like that planned uh for the the next little while so we should be pretty good locked in on the thursday night sked for those of you who are maybe catching this for the first time we're usually live thursday nights at 9 p.m eastern time right here at twitch.tv slash ohp developments if you're here for the first time make sure you hit that follow button down below a uh, few things of housekeeping before we get going first up if you're new out of the park baseball 22 is available right now for 50% off on Steam, 50% off over at OGBDevelopments.com as part of the All-Star Game sale. Pick it up now, 50% off before it is gone. Also, if you're in the PTCS Bracket 2, it is tomorrow. So make sure you clear your schedule, tell your family to leave you alone. You're going to be occupied all afternoon as we find out who the last batch of teams that are going to be in the finals, which will be going next month, um, also, we announced the next format for the Master Series. The next Master Series event goes on uh, August 7th, and it is going to be an open 1750 cap limited to cards from 1980 to 1992, which is the defense era in game. There will be a DH, and the stat factors will be set to 1986 little bit to chew on there for sure bing bang boom i'm back i'm fired up i hope you guys are fired up it is friday night and we are here on the stream it's going to be a lot of fun let's let's get let's get to it let's let's get to skippy with it and start showing off some cards what do you say what do you say let's jump in first off Let's make sure uh, we got the slide all set up the way we want it to. We do bing, bang, boom. Bada, bada. Let's fill the Friday diamond cap. All right. Before we get going, call to arms, ladies and gentlemen. Let's listen. We're going to do it live. Let's do it. We're going to do it live right now. If you are if you got a tournament slot out there, open up your game. Open up your game with me, folks. Let's all do this together. I can't because my Steam is signed out, but it's coming up. If you got a free tournament slot, let's help out the guys. Let's get the Friday Diamond Cap going. It's really simple, easy to do. It's cap, so you can build your team in 875 different ways. Go to traditional tournaments. Uh, go to where it says, um, is there a slot for caps? Oh, you can hit, uh, there is a checkbox for only capped tournaments. Why isn't it there? Does that checkbox not work? Why doesn't people? Why don't people tell me these things before I get going and looking at stuff? Is it still? Uh, is it in the quicks yet or no? Is it still in the weeklies? Or is it in the quicks now? Anyway, listen, the guys in the chat will help you out, okay? Go fill the tournaments, get them filled, follow the leaders, 
Let's get it done. 95 of 128. It's in the quicks. Scroll down, find it, jump in there, win yourself a bunch of something because you're worth it. Now, let's get to work. Ladies and gentlemen, we've got hot, hot, hot content. Yes, yes, we do. Boom! New limited edition card this week is Jim Clancy. 1982 Toronto Blue Jays Jim Jimbert Jimbert Clancy checking in at 96 overall diamond 89 sub 80 movement 89 control 83 77 89 against the lefties 93 83 89 against the righties fastball slider fork ball with 80 stamina 85 sack bunt again gotta get the bunt down Jim Clancy is your limited edition character this week now uh, isn't reading chat. I do not read chat very often. Not going to lie. There's 500 people in here. I, 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 I try. I, I, I try to read as much chat as I can, but difficult. Also, we only have a half hour, so I'm trying to keep it relatively on the rails as much as humanly possible. Um, so, Jim Clancy is the limited edition this week. A little inside information into this week's content theme. Some of the content themes of late we've been doing kind of era-based. We did the 70s and 80s uh, era. We did uh, a dead ball era not too long ago. Now, tonight is a little bit of homage. Now, I mentioned on the stream, I don't know if it was last week or the week before, uh, about um, one of my favorite Conan O'Brien skits was the old-timey baseball skit. One of my other favorite Conan O'Brien skits was the In the Year 2000 skits, uh, which are great. So tonight's set is a 12-pack of cards uh, dated between 2000 and 2009, filling out the early 2000s uh, set. Let's jump in. Let's get in there. Let's, let's kick it off with Pat Neshek of the Minnesota Twins. 2006 rookie sensation Pat Neshek. 139. Now, this is a card. This is an interesting, <laughs> interesting look at card. 139 stuff, 38 movement, 84 control. Uh, apparently, it's the Friday Diamond Cap. The guys can tell you in the uh, Devin in the chat will probably tell you which one we're looking for. Uh, fastball, curveball, slider, uh, curveball, slider, both triple digits. Uh, 122, 36, 84 against lefties. 153, 40, 84 against righties. What a crazy profile here on the rookie sensation. Pat Nishak. Get him. Get him while it's hot. Next up, we've got, you like to play games? I like to play games. Milton Bradley, the game master himself, also likes to play games. 87 gold, Milton Bradley from the 2003 season. 92 contact, 86 gap power, 51 power, 73 eyes, 73 avoid case, 98, 97, 58, 75, 77 against lefties, 90, 83, 49, 72, 72 against righty, 63 speed as well. Uh, center field is the only position, 76 range, 76 air, 59 arm. Probably not going to get it done in the outfield, but if you're in a pinch in a gold tourney, could help you out. Very solid bat, especially against lefties. Very solid bat against lefties, for sure. Defense leaves something to be desired. Milton Bradley. Next up, we've got JT Snow. This is latter tail end of his career. JT Snow, 2004 with the San Francisco Giants. 93 contact, 86 cap power, 63 power, 76 I, 70 avoid caves. Look at those attributes against righties. 96, 90, 67, 79, 73. Uh, in the informer, JT Snow. Exactly. Great call. Great reference. Real Ted. I love it. Great reference. Solid defensive. Now, again, JT Snow was very good in his prime defensively. Again, this is later JT Snow. Started slipping a little bit. He's got the 50 range, 62 error. Uh, but a very... Solid, uh, no, I did not. Uh, very solid defensively, nonetheless, especially for a gold. Let's jump into the diamonds now. We're gonna stick with the Giants this time. We're going to 2000 Ellis Burks in right field 91 diamond Ellis Burks, 95 contact, 80, 68 gap power, 85 power, 63 I, 80 avoid case, 94 63, 75 68, 79 against lefties. 
95, 69, 88, 61, 81 against Rays. Pretty solid profile on both sides. Again, not a whole lot um, to offer defensively for Burks. Uh, 79 range, 68 air, 41 arm. Eh, not great, but very solid low diamond bat. Could be a guy you're using a pinch hitting situation on the bench, which is snaggle speak for bench. Obviously. No duh. Next up, we got Brian Roberts. Orioles fans rejoice. I have not forgotten about the Brian Roberts. 91 diamond Brian Roberts. 82 contact. 100 gap power. 54 power. 71 eyes. 72 avoid Ks. 79 and 99. 45, 79, 71 against lefties. 83, 157, 68, 72 against righties. Some very solid speed. For B Rob as well, with the 89 speed, the 89 ceiling, and the 98 base running. Now, unfortunately, Robert's not a very good defensive guy out there at the old uh, Keystone. 67 range, 75 air, 46 arm, 6 turn double play. Definitely was a liability during his career uh, at the second base position for the Orioles, but very solid hitter. Uh, was a wonderful. Uh, Wonderful part of those Orioles teams uh, in the late 90s, early 2000s. Do -do 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 -do. Next up, where are we at? Eric Bedard! A little more Canadian content in there. 93, speaking of the Orioles, Orioles, back-to-back -back Giants, back-to-back -back Orioles. Have I lost my mind? Possibly. 118 stuff, 63 movement, 66 control. 121, 65, 67 against lefties. 117, 62, 66 against righties. Fastball, sinker, curveball, and a 105 change fees. Mwah, chef's kiss. 89 stamina as well with the ground ball uh, tendency. 96 to 98 miles an hour. 69, very nice sacrifice bunt there from uh, Bedard. Eric Bedard. Eric Bedard. Next up, we're going to the Cardinals. Man, man, we're doubling up on teams. Funny how that works. 2005 Hardware Heroes, Chris Carpenter. I guess this could technically qualify as Blue Jays content. Maybe, sort of, kind of, sort of Blue Jays content, I guess. 88 stuff, 89 movement, 91 control, fastball, sinker, curveball, slider, changeup, 85, 86, 90 against lefties, 91, 91, 92 against righties. Extreme ground ball, 100 stamina as well. Very, very solid diamond piece for Chris Carpenter here. Holy bajoli. Bunt leaves a little something to be desired. 58 sack bunt. I'd like to see that a little higher. I'd like to see a little more focus, you know, on the fundamentals, getting it around, getting the grip, letting the bat, deading the ball. I'd like to see a little more focus on fundamentals, but very nice card here for Chris Carpenter. Let's keep on keeping on. We got another 95 starter. This one is Brad Penny. Pete, Brad Penny. 89 stuff, 83 movement, 86 control, fastball, curveball, splitter, 90, 85, 88 against lefties, 88, 82, 85 against righties, 78 stamina as well. Again, something to be desired on the sack bunt, 55. We know Brad Penny, you know, was not really, you know, focused on the bat, but that's okay. We love him just the same. Speaking that, I, I said Cardinals earlier because now we got another Cardinal. Matt Morris. Peak Matt Morris. 98 diamond. Matt Morris. 80 stuff. 93 movement. 94 control. 78, 91, 93 against lefties. 83, 85, 94 against righties. Fastball, sinker, cutter, curveball, slider, changeup. You got the ground ball tendency as well. 95, 97 miles an hour with 85 stamina. And again, great sack bunt. Fundamentals. We love the fundamentals here on the show. Exclamation point bunt in the chat. If you love fundamentals too, we got the 83 sack bunt out there. Matt Morris, a very, very, very 
very nice card here as well. Where are we at? I got to check my notes because I'm all over the road. We got three more cards to go, and they are absolute 2000s bangers. First up, Bobby Abreu. 99 Diamond Bobby Abreu. Man, this card's got some interesting things happening with it. 90 contact, 103 gap power, 69 power, 102 eye, 65 avoid case, 80, 87, 58, 86, 57 against lefties, 93, 109, 72, 107, 67 against righties. You got the little bit of speed in there as well, 82 speed. And then again, interesting outfield profile, not a whole lot. Of range, 53 range, but 93 air, 88 arm, had a hose, didn't drop a lot of balls. Problem is, he didn't get to a whole lot of them. Home run derby swing casualty, Bobby Abreu. Very, very, very well put. I really, you guys really need to start writing this material for me. You, you really need to start writing this material for me that's a really good one i like it we're not done we've got two not one but two perfects at the top of this set as well first up it's pujols the machine is in the building albert pujols peak the dude's been around for 20 years feels like he's been gone for the last eight of them but he's been around for 20 years. Albert Pools, 100 overall peak, 99 contact, 97 gap power, 100 power, 69 I, 85 avoid Ks, 104, 102, 106, 75, 91 against lefties, 97, 96, 98, 67, 83 against righties, uh, 42 speed, which is probably super generous. Not going to lie. Super generous. Uh, you get the first base, little springs to left field. You're not putting him in left. Listen, let's be real to each other for one moment here. I am not a guy who typically evaluates cards. That's not really my role. You're not playing Albert Pujols in left field if you have one of these cards. I'm just, let's just, just put that out there. Real world talk. You're going to put him at first base. 76 range, 70 air, 45 arm. He can get it done. He can get it done at the one bag. That's where you need him. Last but not least, how is it going to be anybody else but Bartolo Colon? How? You guys are completely off the scent. Nobody thought it was going to be. I even tweeted out a gif of Bartolo Colon earlier. Big, sexy, woo! 128 stuff, 81 movement, 98 control. Fastball, sinker, slider, and the 111 changeup. 118, 77, 97 against lefties. 136, 84, 98. Absolutely going to dominate righties. Oh, big sexy. How? Just, you need him. Big sexy. Perfect team legend. Big sexy. The perfect team. Uh, listen, you, you can't give a guy... He had one home run! If you give him, like, 80 power, everybody's going to say, oh, it's unrealistic, he had one home run. He had one. To be fair, though, oldest guy in Major League history to hit his first career home run. Thank you to DRC for the tap on that one. Keeping his, uh, his factoids alive through me which I greatly appreciate. I don't think I told him I was going to use it, but here we are. There you have it. Penny, Morris, Cologne, Pujols, Abreu, Carpenter, Bradley, Burks, Bedard, Roberts, Snow, Neshek. An absolutely amazing set of content here tonight for the year 2000s. Oh, baby. Lots of hot fire things that you can be pulling. You got some gold, nice gold pieces out there. A couple of low diamond cards in there as well. You got the Carpenter and the Morris for the Cardinals fans. You got Abreu. And then you got Cologne and Pujols 
on top. Man, oh man, lots of fun things to get into in packs. And again, they'll be available in packs at 9 p.m. Eastern time. So about 40 minutes time, we'll get these into packs for you guys. So again, 9 p.m. Eastern, we'll have them in there. For you guys um are we gonna hear about your vacation no you're not gonna hear about my vacation my vacation is my personal time no somebody did ask in the chat if i had ice cream yes i had an amazing scoop of heavenly hash ice cream yesterday it was delicious not gonna lie very very good ice cream Yes, but my vacation was great. Thank you guys so much for being uh, patient and, uh, you know, still supporting the stream, even though we are not on our usual night. Um, it, it was not going to lie. Uh, it was very, very nice uh, to get away for a week and uh, just kind of decompress and chill and, and, you know, just exist in the world. So I appreciate all you guys for being cool upstanding people all the boys and girls all the boys and girls of the ootp community i greatly appreciate you guys uh keeping it between the lines uh for the last week while i was gone now i'm back and here's the best part only six days until we get to do this again because next week we'll be back regular time regular space regular channel right here at twist tv slash otp developments thursday nights 9 p.m eastern time for a brand new hot fire, super powered, supercharged, full impact episode of This Week in Perfect Team. And again, make sure you guys stick around. Dishnet's going to be live here in just a few minutes with this week's edition of the TWIPT Weekly Showdown, which is why we're going to get out of here a bit early. I don't want to cut into his time. I don't want to cut into the great uh, production that they do with the Weekly Showdown. So I'm going to just get on out of here. I'm going to let Dishnet do his thing. Make sure you guys stick around and support him again. These cards will be in packs in 40, uh, 37 minutes time. 9 p.m. Eastern time. Guys, thank you guys so much for swinging by the stream. Oh, that's the wrong button. Wrong button. Uh, I greatly appreciate all your faces. Again, if you're new to the channel, make sure you hit that follow button down below. Like I said, stick around for the best esports competition weekly show longest running ever. I know that's not really a sentence, but it is. Thank you guys so much. As always, I have been Chris Jardine, Director of Live Content Services for Out of the Park Baseball. And until next time, keep swinging for the fences.